Hi, my name is Ray White. I'm the site director of the Dish Network Service Center in Spartanburg, South Carolina. Dish Network is the third largest paid TV provider nationwide. We're a Fortune 200 company. Our mission is to receive, refurbish, and redeploy set-top boxes to support our customer base. Dish Network deployed Sato's GY412 two-sided thermal printers to produce two-sided thermal labels for their outbound packages. Teaming with a national label converter, Dish Network designed their two-sided thermal labels to create proprietary functionality and system visibility of inbound packages to Dish. Hello, I'm Sandy Parlier. I'm the Dish Network Logistics Manager. Our returned equipment arrives by truck. We unload it using conveyors. The equipment then is processed through an automated box opener. We process the equipment through receiving to close the assigned RMA. In addition to our set-top boxes, we refurbish and retest our accessories. Items such as remotes, switches, and LNBs are refurbished for reuse by our customers. Within a production cell, receivers are processed through a visual cosmetics inspection to ensure product integrity and quality appearance, where after they receive updated firmware and the unit is then placed for firmware burn-in. After extensive operational tests are applied and the receivers pass the test, it's moved into inventory. When an order is received, the receiver is taken out of inventory and packaged in preparation for shipping to a customer. The duplex labels are applied to the carton. The carton then is placed on a parcel truck for shipment to the customer. Taking to heart its position as a corporate leader in the community, Dish Network proudly recycles up to 99.9% .9 of its materials, thereby reducing its carbon footprint and environmental impact. Batteries returned are removed during the receiving process and are sent to a local recycling purveyor. Styrotype packing material is processed through a densifying machine, cubed and placed on pallets where it will then be shipped to a recycling partner who remolds the cubed material back into various forms of packing material for other industries. So when one of our customers wants to exchange a receiver for any reason, whatever it might be, it might be because they, they spilled coke on their receiver, it might be because the receiver is broken, it might be because they want to upgrade the receiver. For any of those reasons, we ship an exchange receiver to that customer. Our previous solution involved putting a return label inside the box and pre-packing packing that receiver out at some point in time. Then putting it on the shelf, and then as we needed that receiver, we'd pull it down off the shelf, put a shipping label on it, and ship it to the customer. The issue with that particular solution was that we had no flexibility in identifying the return location for that receiver. We were stuck with what we had. We were looking for a solution that enabled us much more flexibility, enabled us to provide uh, visibility of these shipments as well. We were looking for something that could be externally applied to the carton at the time of shipping. And we looked at a lot of different solutions. We looked at uh, inkjet printers, we looked at laser printers, but we found that the cost and the size of the equipment were all prohibitive. And we also looked at trifold type uh, solution, which again, the cost of that, uh, the application of it, was just not practical for our uses. Sato provided a uh, solution for us where we could print on both sides of the label. We found uh, that Sato had a thermal printer uh, that enabled us to print both sides of the label. And in the process of that, we also found a vendor that was willing to work with us to design a label that would uh, enable us to peel the outbound label off, turn it over, apply that back to the box, and then uh, have the shipping label, the return label, you know, on the outside of the box. We were involved in their pilot, which was fantastic. We started shipping out of Spartanburg, South Carolina. We shipped out of one location using one printer. We did that for about three months. The pilot proved to be very, uh, very effective, and we expanded that now until uh, the point now where we are uh, we're fully engaged. Uh, all exchange shipping is using this auto printer and a double-sided, double adhesive thermal label. The value in this solution has been all around the visibility that it provides to our inbound shipments 
so that we can do workforce planning. It tells us you're getting these models at these locations so we can adjust our workforce to meet that requirement. The second advantage is just that last minute ability to steer our product. And I can say we need to start steering our set-top boxes coming out of Texas. We need to start steering those to Spartanburg because we're getting overloaded in Texas. Let's change that. We can change that today. We can change that immediately. The advantage this provides to the customer is that um, the customer now has a label that's on the exterior of the box. It's uh, easier to use, uh, easier to locate. In the past, we had some issues where the label inside the box uh, got lodged up underneath some of the flaps and things, got lost in some of the materials that were inside the box. The customer couldn't find it. And now we have the label on the outside of the box, much easier for the customer to locate and use. It's a customized shipping solution versus a generic shipping solution. You know, I mean, that's a huge benefit to us. Dish Network uses Sato's GY412 thermal printer with 2ST technology. Dish Network, deploying leading-edge technology to provide world-class customer service.